Hello, and welcome to the first episode of Noah's Feud Review. Today we will be reviewing Quest Miracle Whip. In the Quest Miracle Whip, there is 30 calories per serving. So, I personally have enjoyed Miracle Whip on quite a few occasions. So, this should be pretty interesting. I have never ate a whole spoonful at one time. So, as you can see, the jar is almost empty because I love Miracle Whip, so I like Miracle Whip. But, here you can see the texture. Very creamy. Alright, so let me try some. Let me get some out of here. Okay, so here you can see one spoonful of Miracle Whip, and let's try it. So, overall, I will have to give Craft Miracle Whip original dressing on the food scale rating a 7 out of a 10. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next Lunchables Mini Hot Dogs. As you can see here, on the package we have two hot dogs, a Hershey's socket bar, and a Capri Sun. So, I took them out the box and I've warmed them up for us. And here we go. I am putting mustard on it because I don't like mustard. I like ketchup and me with whip. So, after I warm up, my first thoughts are, it's like, this is it. I need like six more of these to like fill me up. But, anyhow, so, I reckon we'll try them. up too long. I think it's just the bread is going to verge of being stale. Um, the hot dog is just like a normal hot dog you got the store. So I can't have any complaints on that. So, just the hot dog part of this. I'll give this a 6 out of 10 on the food review scale. So let's try some bonus chicken wings, honey barbecue flavor. So, I was walking into the Walmart, right, and I seen this bag sitting in the food, I said, oh my god, look at the picture of them chicken nuggets right there, that looks good, I mean, look at the bag, look, look at the texture on this bag, alright, so, I got me a bag of two of them, and I want to scratch some of them for you guys, so I warm me up some, if you can see here, they look pretty close to what they do on the bag. That's nice, but you know, a lot of stuff looks completely different than that on the back. So, I warm me up some. And can you believe I got them in the back of the bag? You're only supposed to eat three of these at one time. That's supposed to be your meal. Are you kidding me? I can eat like 30 of these probably. Because these are like, they look delicious, man. You know what I'm saying? Right. Anyhow, so let's try them. So, I just, I just picked this one up, so, you can see here, the texture, very nice, you know, yep, there it is, okay, so, let's just try it. Okay, so that was very, very tasty. Because I myself, I'm a fan of McDonald's chicken nuggets, right? And I'd much rather have this than McDonald's chicken nuggets. But the batter on these bad boys, oh my god, that's ridiculous, man. These things are delicious. And so on the bag, it says like warm up for two minutes or something. I did like four minutes and a half. And they're like really warm on the inside, you know? Which I like, because I like my food hot. So. So I tried one of them, you know, it's very, very tasty. So, on the food scale, I would have to give 
Tyson's Chicken Nuggets, a 9 out of 10. They could be better, probably if I put them in the oven, like they're supposed to do, but who's got time for that? You know, anybody got time for that? So, we did a microwave, and they're, they're pretty good. So, I, myself, I'm going to finish this bag, I mean this plate, off camera. And I'll catch you guys next time on the next Another episode of Noah's Cheese Review. No, guys, I am not dead. I am still living and eating just fine. So, anyway, today we are going to review reviewing Rich Peanut Butter Crackers. So, it says here it's made with real peanut butter. Not that it really matters, but, you know, whatever. And, so, let's just eat some. I don't feel like reading that. Let's just eat I'm hungry. I ain't ate in like one hour, so I'm hungry. So there's the cracker. Right there, you can see the peanut butter coming out of your cracker. So it's got salt all over it. I like salt, so let's try it. So, overall, these crackers are pretty tasty. I will definitely be eating more of these crackers as the day goes on. Because we bought a whole box of them. So, I made a lot of them. I'll probably, probably get some more right now. So, I give Rich Peanut Butter Crackers um, on the fruit show, I give it a 9 out of 10. Because it's very salty. I love salt. So until next time guys, this has been Noah, and I'll see you guys later. Always eat good, not healthy, just eat whatever you want, because you know, who cares? Okay. See you guys. Punch down. So nice crispy shred, lettuce shred, not holy lettuce. They also have spinach, pickles, some other stuff like that. This is really good. I don't think I'd recommend get parmesan on. They were out of parmesan when I went today. That's the onion. Onion fella. Guys, Noah Wix here with another food review. Today we're going to be reviewing the bacon, egg and cheese croissant from Dunkin' Donuts. Here it is. See on the inside, got the bacon and the cheese and the egg. Alright, let's try this out. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, you taste the egg right off the bat. Mm -hmm. Some sort of cheese sauce. And you taste the bacon. And a nice buttery flaky croissant. Very good. Very good. Very tasty. Mm -hmm. You can get two of these for five dollars at Dunkin' Donuts. Now I rate this um, I'd say maybe about a eight, eight out of ten. I rate this. Welcome to Noah's Food Review, and today I'm uh, I'm pretty excited because we're doing some uh, some new stuff. I'm trying some new stuff as well as uh, eating stuff that I, I really like. And um, so let's just get start. Um, here we have uh, a grape. Now, I've, I've never seen a fruit before, so I think this is a grape. Um, 
So I'm just gonna I'm I'm just gonna taste it. Uh, it's not really my cup of tea. I give that, I give that one about 3 out of 10. That one wasn't very good. <laughs> Sorry, grapes. Um, uh, so let's, uh, wash my, wash my mouth out with some, uh, some Taco Bell sauce. It's, uh, it should, it should be pretty good. It's pretty good. I give that about a six out of ten. It's Taco Bell sauce. It's pretty good. Um. So uh, next.